A fantabulous wishes to everyone. I am Yarin. I am representing the invention entitled A Study on the Usage of the Selective Agricultural Waste as a Concentrated Fodder in Enhancing Cow's Milk Quality as an Alternate to Lactation. So, what is the soul of the objective is by using agricultural waste as a concentrated fodder, this fodder keeps the cow more stronger and the milk produced by this was suggested to all age people, especially to newborn babies, children, patients, pregnant and lactating women. So now we will see what is A1 milk and A2 milk. A1 milk is the most abundantly available and the most commonly consumed milk today. A1 milk is obtained from cows of western origin like Jersey, etc. and it heals large quantities of milk. And now we will see what is Hato milk. Hato milk is obtained from cows of Indian origin like Gir, Shaiwal, etc. and it heals small quantities of milk. So, due to the differences in availability, A1 milk is relatively cheaper and easier to find than A2 milk. So, one of the main reasons behind the spark of this discussion is the presence of BCM protein, that is beta casein morphin. This protein, it is presented in A2 milk and this protein, it is not presented in A1 milk. And it has been held responsible for several undesirable health consequences. So now we will see the formulation of Tarin fodder. In this, we were used to raw materials or grinded separately and then mixed it together. Now we will see the ingredients. The ingredients are maize, wheat, pure millet, cotton seed cake, drowned cake, bellard doll, split rice, pigeon peas, wheat bran, rice bran, doll husk, roasted gram, skin husk, mineral mixture salt and dry granules. Uh, these are the toilet fodder which were used in this product. So benefits of using these ingredients are maize. First we will see about maize. A uh, maize produces rich and nutritious green fodder and it is a good source of carbohydrate. Then wheat. Wheat has more protein, less fiber and higher value than barley and oats. Next pure millet. Pure millet is known to produce small nutritious cereal grain. And then groundnut oil cake. Groundnut oil cake is one of the best protein supplement to livestock feeding and is extensively used. And then peas and peas split rice. Peas and peas split rice is rich in protein, dietary fiber, magnesium, phosphorus, potassium, copper and manganese. And then last mineral mixture. Mineral mixture contains all essential minerals in required quantities, which is a blend of high quality vitamins and minerals. So these following raw materials are grinded separately, then mixed together in the following grinded ingredients. So what is the conclusion? By giving this feed, a cow can give birth to 10 calves with high yield milk. This feed will help the cattle to remain healthy and the milk produced by this was suggested to lower the blood pressure level, cholesterol level, blood glucose level and boost the immune system. Hence, it is included that Tarin fodder is an excellent supplement and suggested to all age group people. Thank you.